Hi guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new, I hope you enjoyed the video and you decide to subscribe. And if you're a current subscriber, welcome back and thank you so much for your love and encouragement. Today is our third episode of Happy Planner Basics and I'm going to be going over all of the different extensions and supplemental planners that you can pick up. Um, so okay, one thing I wanted to kind of talk about my camera's acting a little weird, like it refocuses on its own, and I've got to play, mess with the settings on it, but I noticed when I was watching one of my videos, like you could hear it click when it would refocus, and that's going to drive me crazy. Um, my life has been completely insane for the last two months. I've been driving back and forth to my parents' house like once a week, and they live three hours away, so it's been kind of hectic, and I haven't had time to really play with my camera and all of that. But that is about to settle down a bit, and I'm going to have a lot more time. So, um, so yeah, I'm going to get that fixed. Just wanted to let you guys know. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to jump right in here. Okay, so first I want to talk about extensions. <laughs> There's a lot of them. And I've got a few examples that I can show you. But an extension is basically a set of planner pages. It'll have like a month. And then the weekly um, the weekly spreads and they usually come in six months some of them only come in four but the first one I'm going to talk about is the monthly it comes in the classic size it is a 12 month planner but it only has like the monthly view and then a notes page there isn't there aren't weekly pages honestly I'm thinking about picking it up if you if you do like bullet journaling or you want to make your own spreads that would be a great way to have dividers for each month so and, and it's undated so and it'll come with a sticker sheet with you know the months and some numbers and all that kind of stuff on it and you can decorate it and do it you know set it up on your own um, the next one is the vertical extension and it's just the regular vertical layout um, if you haven't watched episode two talking about all the different layouts you might want to go back and watch that first um, because I'm not going to go into explaining all of the different layouts in this video. We would be sitting here forever again if I did that. Okay, and it comes in classic, big, classic and big. I did not see one for many, but there might be one somewhere out there floating around. I'm not sure. I went to the Happy Planner website and looked at what was available. And But you might want to check like... Amazon or eBay if you're looking for a vertical mini but I don't think that they have an extension pack for the vertical mini but anyway it comes in six months now the horizontal layout comes um, there's one in the mini but I did not find one for the big and the classic so that's you know that's another kind of weird thing and it also comes in a six month pack the weekly dashboard you guys know what that looks like I plan in it every week it comes in mini classic there's actually two different ones with different dividers in the classic and a big it's probably my most favorite extension I'm going to be picking up another one but I've used it a lot um, and then the monthly dashboard that's like uh, my vintage botanical that you've seen it's that type of layout it comes in mini classic and big and it's also a six month and then you have the hourly and it comes in classic and big and I actually have an example of that that I will share um, because I don't think I showed the hourly on my this is what um, no this is the monthly sorry guys I grabbed the wrong one I thought I grabbed an hourly Okay, well, <laughs> this is the monthly dashboard layout, and this is what the mini and the classic also look like, and this got the daily to-dos, and there's, you know, a section there for each day of the month, and then there's two big note pages, and then, like, a currently type page for your next one. Hang on just a second. Let me go grab, let's see. Oh, that's still that one. I'm just going to explain it because I would have to dig through my drawer. I just grabbed the wrong one a minute ago. Um, the hourly is like the aligned vertical, like my glam girl, except for it has like the um, times of day 
listed on there. Now it comes in, let's see, it comes in classic and big and it's also six months. Now, the specialty extensions, first you have the budget, and here's an example of the budget extension that's currently available, and all of them look like this, the classic, the big, and this is the mini. It comes with a savings jar, and then this is like the monthly dashboard, and then it has your monthly view, and then there's um, a couple of sheets to list your bills out, and then you have these expense trackers, and I think there's an expense tracker sheet for each week, yep. And then at the end you have a budget review and then it goes into your next month. So that comes in six months and like I said mini, classic, and big. And then you have the fitness. It comes in classic and it's laid out kind of like a vertical but it's got different sections for like fitness type things. It comes in a four month. And then you have wellness and it's same thing. It comes in like a vertical and there's like se sections for individual things. It's classic and it comes in six months. Um, the wedding planner is, I don't know, I don't, I've never bought that, but there are pictures of it on the website if you want to see what goes into it. It's not really a monthly planner. It's more like there's sections on different things that you would plan for your wedding. It is available, I know, at um, on the Happy Planner website and also at Joann's. Um, and it comes in classic. And then there is the home, which I have... And I'll show it to you real quick, just like a quick overview. Okay. It's really pretty. It's got pretty, um, let me get it in the frame. It's got pretty, like a copper foil. And it comes with these daily chore sheets. And I think there's, I mean, there's not very many of them in there, but that's what it comes with. Oh, it's got like daily, monthly, and or weekly and monthly and then I think there's enough pages in here for like six months and then it has a meal planner which this is my thing that I made but it comes with this the weekly menu plans and I think there was enough I pulled some of them out but I think there's enough in there for six months and then it has a little budget section in here and this is my printable from Empower Studio let me get to the actual oh, I don't have it in here Okay, I don't have it in here, but it's very similar to actually, nope, I do. It comes with these, where it gives you a month at a glance, and I think there's enough in there for six months. And then there's a project section that has these project pages, and like these are project page pages that I bought separately. But um, this is what comes in the actual home planner. So that's the like home extension is what it's called. And all of these run like anywhere from like maybe I think 10 to $15. And then you have the Christmas. Um, they've had a couple of different versions. There is one on the Happy Planner website that you can take a look at. I believe I saw it on Joann's as well. And I'm sure some other YouTubers out there have some flip throughs of it. But it's really pretty. It's so cute. And it comes with really cute stickers. Okay, now new extensions that are offered I have not even really looked at yet is the homeschool and I did um, look at the pictures online it comes in classic and it is a color block but it's got extra pages for like attendance and different things like that and it's a four month extension um, the caregiver it's a classic size and it's a like a dashboard type layout and I don't know if it has like extra pages in it or not I'm not sure but all of these have pictures on the happy planner website because they're brand new and it comes in a four months now, um, there is another one, Everyday Goals, and it's a daily planner, but it's sold out. And I wasn't able to tell from the website how many, like how many days it would cover. It looked like it had like four dividers in it, so maybe four months. I'm not 100% sure. So um, I think Kel of a Plan has done a flip through of that one, so check out her channel. Um, she may have a flip through of that one because I know she was really excited about it. Okay, then we go into the, oh, that's the extensions. Now, we also have Happy Notes. The Happy Notes come with a cute cover. They usually come on um, the mini size discs. You can get them in the mini, the classic, and the big. And what they are is they just have, um, they have like, 
think three or four dividers. I take them out and use them in different stuff. And then they have filler paper with each divider. And they're super cute. If you, you know, if you if you didn't see a planner that you really liked, you could find a Happy Notes that has a cover that you like, get some big disc and get an extension and make your own planner. Okay, now I bought the goals when they have um, a bunch of guided journals and this is very similar to that. And this one has four dividers in it. I just bought it, it's brand new. I'm gonna use it for next year. Um, but they usually have like a weekly um, kind of page and then some pages for you to fill out every day and it comes with about four months worth of pages in it and I love the guided journals I think they're fun um, yeah you know, I don't really have time to do fill something like this out daily but I am going to be using this next year and I'll probably you know do it maybe one or two days a week but I'll be sharing that with you Okay, Belle, I see you. Give me just a minute. <laughs> She's, my dog come in here. She just got out of bed. She's wanting to go outside. <laughs> so, anyway, the next is the, um, the Happy Planner Girls uh, Savvy Saver is a budget planner. It's similar to this one as far as, like, the way the pages look. I know it has different dividers in it, um, but it comes in small, classic, and it's for, dated for 2021. Um, let's see. And then there was a, no, it's the Skinny Mini, not the not the Mini, not small. It's Skinny Mini and Classic Size, dated for 2021. Okay, then you have like this one, the regular budget one, and it comes in the Mini and the Classic, and it's undated. And I will flip through one of the months so you can see what it looks like. And I think the Savvy Saver is very similar to this. See, it has like a place to list all your bills and like your savings tracker and accounts. And then it has one of these for each week. I hear you, Belle. Give me just a minute. It's fun having pets, isn't it? I guess I should have shut my door. Okay, now there's also a box kit that's like a budget planner. But it doesn't have those weekly expense pages. It's like just a vertical layout. But it's 12 months and it's undated. And this was also 12 months undated. Um, but the box kit comes with the planner, um, stickers, some sticky notes, and a magnetic bookmark. It's kind of fun. It's been around for a while, but I know it was available on the Happy Planner website. So, that is it. That's all the extensions and all of, like, the supplemental planners that I could find. Now, there might be some more out there that are maybe on eBay or Amazon that I didn't mention, um... So if you come across something, you know, just check it out. Try to find some pictures of it. Usually if you want to see a flip through of any of these, you could search it on YouTube. I'm sure there's a YouTuber that's probably done a flip through of every single one of these extensions. Um, what else was I going to say? <laughs> oh, my dog distracted me, y'all. I'm sorry. <laughs> So, that, um, that covers extensions, journals, and happy notes. Now, next week, I believe I'm going to start on stickers. We're going to do a whole episode just showing you all the different kinds of stickers that are offered by Happy Planner. If you want to check any of these out, you can go down. My Happy Planner link is down below. If you use that, I do earn a small commission. Just, I have to disclose that. Um, um, you don't have to, but you could al always just use the link just to go look. I don't get anything for that, but it's... It would be convenient for you to just go down there and click on it. Um, but that's all I have for this video. Uh, if you have any questions about any of this stuff, go ahead and drop them down below, and I'll get back to you within 24 hours. Um, another thing I wanted to add, that's right, printables. You can also go like on Etsy and Pinterest and get printables that you can print out. And if you have, um, if you have the Happy Planner Punch, you can punch them and put them in. There is also a way to punch them without the punch. Um, and I will do that in a separate video. But basically, you just take a one-hole punch, punch it, and then cut a little slit. And it will slide on there just like a regular Happy Planner page. It's a little bit tedious to do that, but it is possible. Um, but the printables, if you want to, check out my Pinterest. I have a whole album of 
just free printables. There's tons on there. And all of them I have probably looked at, downloaded. They're all safe. I make sure and check them before I put them on there because I don't want anyone, you know, downloading something and getting some kind of weird virus because of something I posted. So I do, I do check them all. Um, but that's all I have for today. You can also find me on Instagram, Pinterest, and Facebook. The links are down below in my description. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the bell if you'd like to receive notifications. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.